welcome back to Arts and Cast. As you can see behind me, I have a lot going on. I've been putting a lot of stuff off and I thought that bringing you guys along on a little behind the scenes art vlog would put my booty in gear because I gotta get this stuff done. <laughs> I'm currently in the middle of working on this giant Rubik's Cube pillow. I have four sides, I need to make two more. But this space is just a mess, which I think is a reason why my mind has been a mess. Less talking, we're just gonna, I think step one is we gotta organize. We gotta, we gotta figure ourselves out. So for putting all these up on the wall, I use this double-sided extra sticky tape. I don't know, I got it off Amazon and it's really strong and it's really good. It's what I've used to put up all these rugs and I still have a lot extra. So, and it wasn't too pricey. But the reason why some of these are falling down is I use a felt backing because it's cheaper and I like how it feels um, because I just put them on the wall, which makes the tape a little bit hard to stick. So I've had to use a little bit of hot glue. So this really depends on the backing you use, but it is doable. Most of them have stayed up. So that's a pretty good success rate. But I'm just gonna get myself up here. And now we pray. Stay up there. Really taped up. <laughs> Please. No stitchy. This one's feeling really unsturdy. I don't know about her. I don't know. Please. So that's how I do that. Not incredibly sturdy, but they're up there. For the most part, they're staying. So that part's done. I think next step is figuring this out a little bit. It's just getting out of hand. I don't have a place for it all, but we're gonna try and figure it out. I just have everything shoved into different buckets right now. I've been having a hard time finding something that makes it like look good because all the balls get tangled up anyway. I'm just gonna take everything out and we're gonna look at what we got. I have so many other little past projects that I really don't know what to do with. I don't know if that's gonna be, I'm gonna find a solution for that today. A tie-dye kit that I've literally had for years and I keep telling myself that I'm gonna use it. And this is where I keep my gun right now because I don't know how else to keep it and it works pretty well. So we're gonna leave that like that. Ugh, why is it so difficult? I don't know if you can tell by the hair change, but I took another break from this project and it's still not done or even projected. Um, but now I feel ready to get back into it. I have an exciting new rug that I'm putting on my board today that you're gonna have to stay tuned to see what it is, but it's gonna be really cool. And we're gonna get the Rubik's Cubes on there and there's nothing left but to do it. I still think I have to go pick out the yarn to finish these projects, but next step is just projecting and getting everything ready and then we'll get there. This is gonna get done one day. Okay. So as you can see, we're doing the Powerpuff Girls. Very excited, it's gonna be an awesome rug. But as you can also see, I largely underestimated how much room this was gonna take up. So I have this huge chunk here, and I cannot be wasting that much cloth. In this economy, mm -mm. I'm gonna have to go away and figure out what I'm gonna put there. <sighs> this feels like these rugs are just never gonna get done. I just keep having problems, but we're pushing through. <laughs> And yeah, I'm gonna go figure out what I'm gonna do with this empty space. And I'll probably just come back when I've done that and it's up on the board. Hopefully see you guys soon and not in another four weeks. <laughs> Here we are, walk of shame, walk of art shame. As you can see, progress has been done. I have filled in the spot and it also has been months later. A lot of time is, a lot of time has passed. I've been really struggling to get everything done with my ADHD and just focusing on these tasks. It's literally taken me like four months to get to this point. And I just did all the black outline in like two hours. So that did not have to take me that long. I really just thought this was gonna be a fun little vlog to bring you guys along. It has turned into a, a really big mess, but we've got it up on the board. It is now almost October, so I'm working on a Halloween rug. We've got the Powerpuff Girls. Everything is being filled in. I think Rubik's Cube, I have the red and the yellow, so we're gonna work on that. Huh. One day, these will be done. <laughs> keep telling myself that I'm gonna find a better method for my yarn, but I still haven't. So I have a bunch of yarn that I have to ball up. So enjoy a nice little montage of me getting my balls in order. <laughs> We have all the balls. <laughs> and we're just gonna finish this video by getting these squares done, okay? That's what we're doing. It's incredible that it took me four months to get to this point and like three hours to get it all done. <laughs> and I will never learn from this. We will continue to be this way. So 
let's just get these done. Well, that is looking wonderful. We're just gonna swap over these colors here into my handy dandy bucket, bucket of balls, and let's keep going. Wow! <laughs> so I successfully finished the color. I have ran out of all of the yarn that I have. Get to go do another trip to Michael's. So I think I'm gonna end this never ending vlog video here. <laughs> Stay tuned as I will have videos on each of these glorious rugs up on my channel as they get created. And I promise that it won't take months. I am, this is me putting this out and holding myself accountable. Is that a stain? I don't, I did not notice that. Okay, so ignore the titty stain. We just noticed her. We're just gonna trudge on. <laughs> what was I saying? Oh yes. This isn't gonna take months to do. I'm going to finish it. Don't look at her. <laughs> I love filming these behind the scenes and taking you on kind of like my journey of what takes me to get these rugs up and sometimes the reality of that is it's a mess. My brain, ADHD, it's a mess up there. It's so, I guess it makes sense that these videos are also chaotic, but thank you guys so much for watching this video. Stay tuned for the upcoming ones because they're going to be dope. And as always, thank you guys so much for watching. Until next time, peace.